A St. Paul street could be closed for weeks after a rock slide caused slabs of limestone to crash into a roadway. It happened Saturday afternoon around 3.30. Wabasha Street is now closed indefinitely between Plato Boulevard and Cesar Chavez Street. Angela Davis was there as a team of experts took a look at the scene today. I'm standing here at the bottom of the bluff that runs along Wabasha Street just east of downtown St. Paul. Now you can see behind me the large chunks of rock that slid down the bluff and then crashed into the roadway. No one was hurt, no private property was damaged, but it's still quite the sight to see. I can't believe it. I've lived in this neighborhood for 40 years and I've never seen anything like this. A team of investigators from St. Paul Public Works is carefully examining the bluff with the help of outside experts who were called in. They're looking at the stability of the slope before beginning any type of cleanup or repair. Neighbors say there used to be steps built into the bluff in this area. So this would be more unstable anyway because they had the big, long, um, you know, staircase that went up. I mean, it went up a hundred steps, I think. Judy Daniel lives in one of the houses at the top of the bluff right along the edge. These bluffs have been here a long time. I'm not too worried about it. Judy says she's seen rock slides here in the past, but this one seems more serious. She remains hopeful the city will be able to find a safe solution. Others are not so sure. I don't know how the city's going to go up against Mother Nature, but good luck. <laughs> public Works officials for the city of St. Paul are asking the public to stay away from this area until further notice. And if you're driving, to find an alternate route. In St. Paul, Angela Davis, WCCO 4 News. Thanks, Angela. Well